Good morning, everybody. Andrea Maeski here with Dental L Mobile Hygiene. Let's talk about crowns today. So crowns or caps. So what are they? Why would you need one? And how you can prevent yourself from getting one? Um, so I will be talking about a couple of those things today. So basically a crown or a cap pretty much means that we are putting a piece of porcelain or metal over the actual tooth to protect it. So to make the tooth a lot stronger. So a lot of people think, so you're just putting metal over my tooth. That's not going to look very nice, is it? Well, it looks exactly like your tooth. So the person who's looking at you wouldn't be able to tell that that's not, not your tooth and that that's an actual crown. Um, there are different shades though of a crown. So if you opt for a full metal crown, so either it looks silver or gold, then yes, people would be able to tell that that's not your natural tooth. But we do also have a porcelain crown that we can match for it to be the same shade as the rest of your teeth. Now, porcelain isn't as strong as a full metal crown. So if you need a very, very strong crown, which some people do, if they're, for example, clenching their teeth at night, or they just have a very deep, deep bite. So if you've ever been told, oh, well, you're starting to wear down most of your teeth, then that probably means that you have a deep bite and a full metal crown is probably the best option for you. But, but the nice thing is, is that these days you can have a full metal crown with porcelain over top. So that over top of that tooth layer is porcelain and that can match the rest of your teeth. So even if we tell you that you have a deep bite and that you do need the, the you know strongest crown possible, then you can have a full metal crown that looks like your um, teeth that has the same shade as the rest of your teeth. So people often need crowns because they may have a cavity that is so large that we might put either an amalgam or a composite um, um, filling in there. But if the tooth is that large where there's not a lot of enamel left, then that tooth can chip easily. And we don't want that because once a tooth um, chips, we would obviously have to um, fix up that chip tooth, right? But sometimes we can only do so much. So if the if we tell you that your tooth has a very good chance of chipping or cracking, that it is a good idea to put a crown over top of that whole tooth so that doesn't happen. Because crowns are amazing because as I said, it goes over the entire tooth you don't have to worry about it, you know, chipping, cracking, nothing. So it's kind of like it's it's protecting your entire tooth where you don't have to worry about it pretty much. Um, if you have a tooth that has a root canal in it, you should have a crown over top of that because once a tooth has been root canaled, it's a very, very weak tooth. And you don't want that tooth to all of a sudden chip or crack. And if it cracks too much, we can't actually fix the tooth. If it cracks below the gum line, we have nothing to attach onto it, if that makes sense. So if it cracks below the gum line, then we have to take out the rest of the tooth. And you don't want that, especially after you've had a root canal, spent all of that money to save the tooth. You want to keep that tooth how it is. So you should have a cap or a crown over top of it to protect that entire tooth. And then you don't have to worry about it anymore. Um, other reasons why I have seen that people need crowns is if they have a very, very deep um, bite and their teeth are starting to wear down. So much so that they're now in a lot of pain because anytime they, they um, uh, a clench, I guess, is um, the word that I'm looking for. Anytime they clench, all of that pressure is, is um, continuing to be on the back teeth and that can cause pain. So where you are clenching the most, it's a good idea to put a crown or two on those teeth. So you're clenching on the actual crown, 
but not your tooth, if that makes sense. We don't do that as often because typically if somebody's clenching, we would have to put crowns on all of the back teeth, top or bottom, because people clench on their back teeth. And that's expensive. Is that really necessary? Perhaps not. A night guard makes more sense in that case. So that if you are clenching, you are clenching on a night guard and not your actual tooth. Because did you know that when you are clenching at night or during the day, that is 300 pounds of pressure. Imagine 300 pounds of pressure constantly that can make the um, ligaments around the teeth very, very sore. So you don't want that. So typically crowns are for if you've had a large cavity in the past where us having to take the cavity out, you don't have a lot of your natural tooth structure left. It's a good idea to put a crown over top. So if the, so you don't have to worry about the, the tooth now cracking or chipping because it's not your natural tooth. Or if you've had a root canal, it's a good idea to put a, a crown over top of the tooth after that. So then you don't risk chipping a now weak tooth because you want to save the teeth as much as possible, trust me. And yes, crowns can be expensive. There's a, there are about eight, eight, $800 to $1,000 a tooth, depending on what tooth it is and the type of crown that you will make. But that, you know, means so much more than having to take a tooth out because then you don't have a tooth and you have other problems, you know, eating won't be as easy. And once a tooth is missing, the teeth shift forward and then give it a couple years, you will not be able to bite down properly. You will be eating, you will be um, uh, chewing your food and you can't really bite down properly. Once that happens, once all of the teeth shift, you have bigger problems and you don't want that either. So a crown is actually a, a lesser expensive option than having the tooth pulled. So I hope that helped you guys. If you have any questions though, please let me know about caps, crowns, anything. I am more than happy to talk about it. And thank you guys so much for watching.